What's good, beast hounds? Chip boy, Kick and Rain, coming at you with a quick tip for the kettlebell swing. What is that tip? It's a swing, but not a squat. Pardon? It's not a squat. What? It's not a squat. One more time, say it with me now. It's not a squat. Hope you found this video useful. Drop me a like if you did. Subscribe, and as always, my friends, get them gains. Be well. I've been editing footage from the Beast Games recently, and it made me sad, sad and mad to see some of my very own lads, homegrown for little beastlings that have no excuse not to be cock on with the swing, still squatting a swing. It's not a squat! What the kettlebell swing is, is a hip hinge. You're gonna send your ass back, back and not down, just the same way you would with a good morning. And then you're gonna snap your hips back open, squeezing them strong old glutes and using that snap to send that bell into orbit. Practice that feeling a couple of times. You don't need to wait, I'll wait. So it's not this, it's this. Now all we do is wait it. Start your swing with the bell either out in front of you or between your legs, whatever suits you. You're gonna point your other arm straight out with a tight fist to encourage a strong back, discourage twisting, and overall reduce your potential for injury. If the bell is in front of you, lifting it from the floor is gonna start it swinging between your legs. If you're starting from down there, you're gonna have to snap your hips to get it to start moving. Pointing your thumb back between your legs is gonna help with clearance as the bells get larger, but it can also encourage twisting, which we do not want, so watch out for that. When that bell is on the way down and it's about to smack you in the knackers, you are gonna perform a last second evasion. Literally, as your wrist makes contact with your nards, you are gonna send your hips back, exactly like we just practiced. The bell is gonna continue swinging through the legs. It's gonna reach the apex of its swing and then, whoo, Snap those hips open. Use your body to push the bell hook arm pendulum unit up and away into fricking space. If it doesn't go into space, it'll probably make it to about eye level before coming in for a second attack. Bam! Same thing. Wait until the last second. Send your hips back. Back and not down is the key here. How can I tell if I'm doing that right? Your knees should not move. If your knees move forward, you're squatting. Your knee should stay stationary. Your foreleg, forearm, foreleg. Your shins should not move. Your hips go back, your back stays flat, and you snap your hips open. And throughout this whole cycle, your knees stay still. Your shins stay vertical. You aren't using your shoulders at all to pull the weight up. It's not a front raise. Your arm is just a hook for the bell. You are gonna feel it, definitely, if you're shouldering it up. But it's also super obvious to see because the bell tends to hang in line with gravity still. With a lower body powered swing, the bell should be weightless at the top and act like a pendulum as part of your arm and not like a weight that you're holding in your hand. You can still achieve this with a squat swing, so it doesn't mean you're definitely doing it right. But if the bell is hanging like a handbag, it means you're definitely doing it wrong. This is a squat, this is a swing. You need to develop the feeling that the weight is breaking you at the hips. So your feet are planted, your shins are upright, your knees are stationary, the weight comes down, reaches the hips, the hips move back out the way, the bell reaches its apex and the hips push the weight back up and the swing starts again in the beautiful circle of life. It is all about timing. It's all about the hips and it's so not a squat that the knees should not move. It's not a squat. Well, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, hoya, judo chop that like button. Put on heel, that subscribe and ooh, ring the bell with your gosh darn newly enlightened head. And as always, my friends, get the gains. Be well.